Hey you guys and welcome back to another episode of Assassin's Creed 3. This is Zach from Zach's World Games. When we left off we were Ha Indirect. Suckle. Oh look at the beautiful sunrise. Oh a sundown sunset. Johnson is dead. No. He retreated when we destroyed the team. Only to have some new scheme, I'm sure. You should have killed him. There was no need. Connor, you're an idiot. If you speak the truth. If I had the option to kill the guy, I freaking would have. I do not allow people to take things that aren't theirs that are mine. Oh my god. Now this is gonna be bad. Why are you here? Has something happened? William Johnson has returned with all the money required to buy our land. He meets with the elders as we speak. I have begged him to resist, but I fear he shall have his way unless you intervene. How is this possible? We destroyed the tea. The Templars are nothing if not resourceful. You should have heeded my warning. Please, you have to stop him. Of course. Can you tell me where they're meeting? Oh, you don't need your can anymore, dude? Are you getting better? Let's use this. Okay, we must hurry to save. See, Wi-Fi, Wi-Fi. Look at that. Oh, I thought I thought it actually said internet. And I was like, oh my god. But no, it says interactive. So no, I'm just gonna say it's Wi-Fi because I say that that looks like the Wi-Fi connection symbol. If 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 you don't um want that, then don't do anything similar to it. I don't know what I'm saying. I'm just, I, I think it's Wi-Fi. Last episode, we had this discussion. Ish. I just noted it was Wi-Fi. Anyway. Anyway. Connor. Right side. Right side! Stock side! Stucko! Come here, horsey, horsey. Come here, horsey, horsey. Good boy. Let's get out of here. I really don't feel like traveling again. Last episode that took so freaking long. <laughs> Wasn't that the greatest impression of a horse you've ever heard? Say yes or I'll murder you. Yes. Good. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm gonna kill your family. What? What? I said yes. Yeah, I said I would kill you. But I never said anything about not killing your family. Don't you... Oh, I was gonna say we could cross. And then I was gonna try to jump off the horse. But then it looked like the horse was gonna try to run into the water. Which I didn't... Dude. What are you? Are you a traveling... Trade? No, I don't need to trade. Excuse me. Oh no. Oh crap. I can't help but think I'm going the wrong way. Yeah, I'd say this is the wrong way. God dang it. Can we cross this, please? Yes, awesome. Oh, wait. This isn't the wrong way. Awesome.
Y'all can't touch these suckers. Oh god. Ugh. Hey. How's it going, buddy? Oh man. Really? Well, that's okay. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Look at that. No, come here, please. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Nope, you're not worth it. I have to start the mission. I'll kill you later. Zoom, 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 zoom. Stop mission. Suck. Well, I kind of got a layout for. Everything. Oh, really? I just came from up there. What? Oh, oh boy, that was scary. Look at the tree, perfectly in line for me. Screw free running. I'm a tree runner. If you detect me, that means you're racist. Oh. Never mind. Don't detect me. But you're still racist. Yeah, restricted area, I know. Crap. Oh no! I still think it would be a huge help if you could have a button that would have you remain crouched. You know, like a Call of Duty or something. You know, you can crawl or crouch around. I think that'd be cool. What is this over here? I saw something moving over here. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I'm just saying things because I'm crazy. Oh. Well, now I can hear him talking and see subtitles. Oh, yeah. Without getting peace, peace. detected. Have I not always been an advocate? Have I not always thought to protect you from harm? If you wish to protect us, then give us arms, muskets, and horses that we might defend ourselves. War is not the answer. We remember, Stanwyck. We remember you moved the borders. Even today, your men dig up the land, showing no regard for those who live upon it. Your words are honeyed, but false. We are not here to negotiate, nor to sell. We are here to tell you and yours to leave these lands. So be it. I offered you an olive branch, and you knocked it from my hand. Oh, God. You'll respond better to the sword. Are you threatening us? Yes. 
Well, guess what, buddy? I'm gonna freaking murder your face off. Actually, it's not murder because it's justified. Goodbye. Took your friend with you. Oh no. What have you done? Ensured an end to your schemes. You sought to claim these lands for the Templars. Aye. But we might protect them. Do you think that good King George lies awake at night, hoping that no harm comes to his native subjects? Are that the people of the city care one whit about them? Oh sure. The colonists are happy to trade when they need food or shelter or a bit of extra padding for their armies. But when the walls of the city constrict, when there's crops that need soil, when there's... when there's no more enemy to fight, we'll see how kind the people are then. The colonists have no quarrel with the Iroquois. Not yet. But they will. It's just the way of the world. In time, they'll turn. I... I could have stopped it. I could have saved you all. You speak of salvation, but you were killing them. Aye, because they would not listen. And so, it seems, neither will you. Don't try to make it justified that you're doing what you're doing. Oh no. Let me out of what the frick is that? That was weird. Oh wait. What? God dang it. Oh crap. I was in the process of dodging that. Crap. Oh yeah. Ow. Crap. Not this again. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Okay. Oh crap. What is this? Oh. T is for Englishman. Not true. I enjoy me a spot of tea every once in a while. Yeah. You play points, sucker. Didn't even give me a chance to escape. I was gonna go kill the guys and throw them in the water. William Johnson is dead, and with him, the Templar plot to steal the land of my people. But in ending this threat, 
I have revealed another. On his body was a letter addressed to John Pitcairn containing orders to root out and destroy Patriot weapons and supplies. Should he succeed in this, the colonists will be unable to maintain their resistance, and the Templars will surely take control. So long as Pitcairn lives, the danger remains. I need to find him. He needs to die. You need to die, my friend. Kill me, I'm gonna have to kill you now. I thought it might bring clarity or instill a sense of accomplishment, but all I feel is regret. Hold fast to that. Such sacrifices must never come lightly. I had to do it. Not only for my people, but for all the others Johnson would have harmed. It's a start. But to truly be free of Templar influence, all of them must be dealt with in turn. Even your father. I know. You speak the words, but do you believe them? Seems we've company. That, that's just okay. We're going to be calm about that. Oh, I see. What is it? A request for aid from Paul Revere. Oh, my God. Seems the Redcoats are up to something in Boston. Guess you made an impression on the Sons of Liberty. They mistake me for one of their own. Please tell Mr. Revere he has my sympathies, but I cannot help at present. You might wish to reconsider. John Pitcairn is mentioned by name. Where am I to go? <laughs> Mr. Revere's house in Boston. If you'd like, I can... Yeah, take me. Because I really don't want to freaking ride there, please. Pretty please. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, no, not the frontier! Oh, God. I don't want it to just take me to the friggin' border. I want it to take me to there. Ah. Uh. I tell you, I love the games, but I hate the traveling. Ink, 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 ink. Anyway. Oh my god. I hate the eye. <sighs> okay. Here we go again. I cannot wait until I start playing Minecraft again. It has been so long since I've posted one of those videos. And if you're wondering why am I not playing it now, it's because the computer I have is absolutely terrible. Half of the buttons on it don't work anymore. The space and D key are, uh, have fallen off fallen off they didn't I didn't break it or anything they just friggin fell off when I was typing um, I basically the only way that I can type things anymore is if I use the on-screen keyboard which is obnoxious because I have to click every single thing with my mouse or I can just use an external keyboard but like that takes up my USB ports which I only have like three and one of them is my mic another one is my what the frick what do you what was that dude what the hell oh my god why is that guy gonna fight me with a drum ow Bring it on.
There you go. Good job. Ow. Crap. What were you saying was starting? I'm sorry I didn't catch that. I was too busy murdering your face off. Let's be sneaky about this. Ish. Got you, I got you, I got you, you're mine, you are 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 mine. You are mine. Yes! Thank you. Elk. Not moose. Hey, bunny. Bye, bunny. Come on. That was probably all just air to you guys. I think I'm losing my ability to whistle. Because I used to be able to whistle, like, so loud. Like, oh, man, it was awesome. But now I'm just like, I can't do it as much as I used to, but then again I haven't really practiced or done it as much as I... Shut up, your stupid drums. Crap. Oh, I was so hoping that he was going to get hit by that guy with the hatchet. Or the axe. That's bigger than the hatchet. Crap. God dang it. Ow. Ow. Stop it. Yeah. I like the way this kind of looks. Just like the way it kind of zoomed in more, more cinematic. I kind of zoom out. So, oh, crazy stuff happening. Zoom. Normal. Zoom. Oh, crazy stuff. Zoom. Normal. Come here. Ah, oh, no. Not wrong button. Yeah. Travel to Boston. Please and thank you. Ugh. Oh, goody. Hello, gentlemen. Oops, don't do that. Attract attention to us. Stupid horse. Ugh. So, how about that show, The Walking Dead? You guys enjoying that so far? I am. I'm not sure I like what happened on the last episode of it, but... I don't know. I'm kind of glad, because, you know, 
but not like, you know, I don't want to give it away. <laughs> yeah. You freaking kids are so obnoxious. You guys are so obnoxious. Don't keep walking in the street. How many times do I have to tell you guys this? You dumb woman. And whoever else continues walking into the middle of the street. Hey, this is where I died one time. Because of that crazy Frenchman. It was right here at this corner. Ah, the memories. Excuse me. Dude, this is a ridiculous travel as well. Ah, my left bicep is friggin' twitching, like spazzing out, like my whole shirt is moving. That is weird. <laughs> that actually kind of like made my hand twitch as well as like, poof, I was like, ah, I'm going to interact. I said interact. There you go. Good job. Ah, oh boy. 27 minutes for me. I really do this for you. Jeez. Barden in. Ah, Connor. What a relief. You came. <laughs> Allow me to... To introduce you to William Dawes and Robert Newman. Oh my Your goodness. Your said John Pitcairn was here. Aye. He's ready to assault on Lexi. Where Adams and Hancock taking shelter. After that, he will march on Concord, hoping to destroy our weapons and supplies. You must help us. Only tell me where to find him, and I will put a stop to this. He has dozens, if not hundreds, of soldiers at his command. You cannot hope to match him by yourself. But fear not, for you will not have to. We have an entire army of our own. Merely awaiting the order to take up arms. Then you must call upon them. Indeed. You must <laughs> <have> <laughs> the charge and the boy. William, I the think he knows not to touch him, man. And do the same. <laughs> Robert, I need you up in Christchurch. Like the signal. Two lanterns, our enemy comes by sea. Oh my freak. That is freaking Paul Revere. That guy doesn't learn. He's like, you touch me, you die. And he just keeps touching him. Just keeps touching. Stop touching me, or I will chop off your hands and eat your fingernails. With chips and salsa. And cheese. But anyway. <laughs> I'm kind of getting a little aggravated. I really want that freaking sword. Huh. They've only left a single horse. We'll have to ride together. Ah. You take the reins, I'll navigate. Quickly, Connor, get on the horse. I'll guide you towards those we need to alert. Follow my directions, and we'll be done in no time. Uh. 
Okay. Keep going. I know. I'm gonna pause it. So, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed and subscribe. Sequence seven. What happened to getting the sword in sequence six? Hold on, I'm reading up on this real quick. You guys are gonna have to sit here. The Swooth Sword. You need Caleb uh, to obtain the sword. Interact with your harbor master and direct your ship. To you will find. What the? What the? Oh, I guess it's after. So I guess it's within or after. Okay, that's not as bad. I'll do that whenever I can. All right. Well. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next episodes. Thanks.